What is up guys and welcome to the third episode of the Road to Messi series. As you see there in the top right hand corner, we have got 712 coins and that can only mean one thing. We have invested a load of our coins into a trade uh, and it's going to be going very, very well. I think we'll be able to make a very substantial amount of profit and for, you know, for actually picking up all of these cards for you know most of the time 1k or less. That is going to be very, very good, and you know, I, could, I just can't wait to see the profit and what the outcomes come um, as. And you know, I think all of these trades that I did were all in one night. You know, I know I've spaced it over three episodes, but it's the easiest, easiest way um, for me to sort of give you guys decent amount of time per episode, and also sort of be able to lay down the law of how I trade and stuff like that, so that you guys can sort of have an easier understanding of how I trade and stuff like that, um, and just personally, you know, try and actually learn uh, better from uh, you know what I'm actually doing. So hopefully that will help um buzz and see here we've got like a given we've got heitinger um and the reason this actual method works so well uh buying you know boxes premier league 442 non-rare shiny players um for you know in open bids for cheaper than their normal price is because a lot of people when they're in open bids they don't really notice they're a 442 formation they kind of just you know look over their card and think you know i'll I might even open. I'm, you know, I might bid, start bidding up to that player. Uh, maybe you know, 200 coins under um, his average price, and then I'll just stop there because there's no real point buying that player for you know his average price because I can just probably buy it for a buy now for maybe like 100 coins under that average price. So. When you actually see a 4-4-2, um, people don't really acknowledge it that well, especially when there's new users in the game. Um, you know, they're all the veterans of FIFA 12 on FIFA 11. Um, you know, you guys will obviously know quite a bit how formations work in the game. But for all the new guys, 4-4-2, uh, 4 4 2, four, one, two and 2, 4 3, three sometimes 4 3 2 one they're all very, very popular formations. And they do actually make card prices a lot more expensive than they what usually would be if they're like a free back formation or a five back formation it is as simple as that and you can actually sell sometimes non-rare players for actually you know double their coins um you know i've, I've had experience with height and girl which i picked up for 1.1k in a 433 so i'm on for 3.3k which you would have seen in the first episode uh so it's a really really easy way and can actually sub you know sort of total out to be a very very nice uh profit that you end up with indeed so we pick up an everington here as well in a 442 uh we actually pick them up for about 1.1k I believe and we can actually probably sell them on for about 1.8k which would be a nice 700 coin profit um you know not the most amazing profit in the world but it's going to be one which will help us get very much closer to having the amount of coins where we can actually start buying the bigger and better players and hopefully be making a lot more profit um you know on the market so and see there we get a right back kelly for 800 coins should be able to sell them on for 1.6k also pick up that right back from chelsea uh the new spanish guy for uh, i think it was 1.1k so kind of overpaid but you know i think at the same time we should still be able to make a very nice profit alan there in a 442 for 800 coins should be able to sell them on for about 1.3 to 1.4k no trouble with that so um i think we will go into the market in a second and i actually i think it might even be on this clip but um I actually I was actually on my other account and I found a uh, I think it's the Arsenal left back and I've just completely forgotten his name but uh, he was up for 350 coins in a 442 now if I was actually got there quick enough and you know actually was able to search that I would have been there making a you know like a 1.5k to 2k profit on that card alone so it might even be worth you know flicking through the best formations and just putting a maximum buy now of say 400 coins on the Barclays Premier League players and just seeing what actually pops up because it is worth it it's worth doing guys sometimes you can pick up some really really amazing deals and uh, you know you can find yourself making a lot of profit but as you see here these are a load of players that actually sold uh, you know Everington, everyone, Upson, um, Andre Santos I think sold a lot of the players but then again a lot of the players didn't sell and that was probably because I was selling them at an off peak time and not a lot of people are actually on uh, obviously it's a good way to sell your players for a bit higher than their normal price but you know I think sometimes you actually have to sell them at prime time to actually get them sold um, obviously when you actually sell them over uh, night a lot of them will sell but not all of them um, and that is the only trouble of selling at off peak times but that's going to be the end of the video if you guys have enjoyed it then please do drop a like 1000 likes would be absolutely amazing guys your support in this series so far has been immense so thanks for watching guys have a nice day and peace